Hey, Lauren, that includes a person who is cutting hair right next door. Here it is. She was in there at the time. She had clients in there at the time, and they had to be locked down inside this hair salon for hours upon hours while this investigation sort of unfolded outside her window. She told me she heard up to seven shots fired yesterday. Let's take a look new at 6 o'clock now at the man charged with attempted first degree murder tonight, assault with a deadly weapon. His name is Antonio Wilkins Sr. He's in the hospital in Greenville right now in stable condition. Police walked us through a detailed timeline of events from yesterday afternoon today over at City Hall. They put up this PowerPoint, which breaks down everything from when they first got an alert about a stolen car up to the shooting here at the Oakwood Shopping Center. So again, this started as police were trying to track a stolen car. They eventually caught up to it, not far from where we're standing here, but Wilkins wasn't in it. Someone else was. That person was questioned and released. Wilkins was tracked here to this shopping center. They started chasing him. They say Wilkins pulled out a gun, shot an officer in his holster. An officer then returned fire. It does butt up against a residential area. I'm not aware of any kids that was there at the time of the shooting. I can't speak to that. There was more than one shot fired by the suspect, which was first, and then our officer returned fire, and there was more than one shot put by our officer. So multiple shots fired. I think it's fair to say that it was a bit of a shootout out here and amazing to think that this situation was contained to what it was considering there is a daycare center out here. You have tons of people walking through the breezeway here, walking around this shopping plaza at around two o'clock in the afternoon. SBI as is protocol and officer involved shootings. They've been called in to investigate those two officers involved on administrative duty. Lauren and Joel, back to you. Okay, Josh Chapin on the latest on that investigation out in Rocky Mount. Josh, thank you. Rocky Mount.